that's also the ongoing mission of Islamic Research Foundation or IRF, spreading the truth of Allah's final message to mankind. Founded in 1991, IRF today offers some of the best services and facilities in the world for presenting an understanding of Islam in an objective and scientific way. Its programs are primarily focused on correcting misconceptions and promoting understanding of Islam. IRF also imparts Dawa training to Dais to aptly convey the message of Islam. Dr. Zakir Naik, President of IRF, reaching out across countries worldwide, from America to Europe to Africa to Asia to Australia, strives to clarify Islamic viewpoints. He dispels the many media myths and anti-Islamic prejudices propagated the world over by anti-Islamic forces. IRF today is creating a change in the hearts and minds of millions of Muslims and non-Muslims worldwide towards a proper understanding and respect for Islam. Have a question or doubt about Islam and its teachings? Now you know, one of the best resource centers to get convincing answers from is Islamic Research Foundation, Mumbai, India. For more information, log on to our website www.irf.net. We find that the international media, they are bombarding misinformation about Islam. Some of the international news channels, they are saying war for peace. The Islamic madrasas should be banned. Why? Because they produce human beings who cause terror. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Greetings and peace be on all of you. I request Brother Arif Zulfar of Dubai International Holy Quran Award Committee to come up and take the mic at the stage. Brother Arif Zulfar, please. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salam ala Rasulullah. Dear honored guest, Dr. Zakir Naik, ladies and gentlemen, under the patronage of His Highness, Sheikh Mohammed bin Rashid Al Maktoum, Crown Prince of Dubai and UAA Minister of Defense, Dubai International Holy Quran Award has the pleasure again in its ninth session to welcome our dear guest, Dr. Zakir Naik. Tonight's lecture, as you know, media and Islam, war or peace. Proceeding to that, I'd like to ask Dr. Hamad Naik and Farik Zakir Naik to proceed to the stage to hear some holy verses from the Holy Quran. Farik Naik is the son of Dr. Zakir. من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم والفجر وليال عشر والشفع والوتر والليل إذا يصر هل في ذلك قسم لذي حجر ألم تر كيف فعل ربك بعاد لرمزات العماد التي لم يخلق مثلها في البلاد وسمود الذين جابوا الصخر بالواد وفرعون ذي الأوتاد الذين تغوا في البلاد فأكسروا في الفساد فصب عليهم ربك صوت عذاب إن ربك لبالمرصاد فأما الإنسان إذا ما ابتلاه ربه فأكرمه ونعمه فيقول ربي أكرما وأما إذا ما ابتلاه فقدر عليه رزقه 
فيقول ربي أهانا كلا بل لا تكرمون اليتيم ولا تحاضون على طعام المسكين وتأكلون الطواس أكلا لما وتحبون المال حبا جما كلا إذا دكت الأرض دكا دكا وجاء ربك والملك صفا صفا وجيء يومئذ بجهنم يومئذ يتذكر الإنسان وأنا له الذكرى يقول يا ليتني قدمت لحياتي فيومئذ لا يعذب عذابه أحد ولا يوسق وساقه أحد يا أيتها النفس المطمعنة ارجعي إلى ربك غاضية مرضية فادخلي في عبادي وادخلي جنتي صدق الله العظيم The translation of the Kirat, Surah Al-Fajr, the Dawn. In the name of Allah, most gracious, most merciful. By the break of day, by the nights twice five, by the even and odd contrasted, and by the night when it passeth away. Is there not in these an adjuration or evidence for those who understand Seest thou not how thy Lord dealt with the Ajj people, with the city of Iram, with lofty pillars, the like of which were not produced in all the land, and with the Thamud people, who cut out huge rocks in the valley, and with Pharaoh, lord of stakes, all these transgressed beyond bounds in the lands, and heaped therein mischief on mischief. Therefore did thy Lord pour on them a scourge, of diverse chastisements, for thy Lord is as a guardian on a watchtower. Now as for man, when his Lord trieth him, giving him honor and gifts, then saith he, puffed up, my Lord hath honored me. For when he trieth him, restricting his subsistence for him, then saith he in despair, my Lord hath humiliated me. Nay, nay, but ye honor not the orphans, nor do ye encourage one another to feed the poor, and ye do our inheritance all with greed, and ye love wealth with inordinate love. Nay, when the earth is pounded to powder, and the Lord cometh, and his angels rank upon rank, and hell that day is bought face to face, on that day will man remember. But how will that remembrance profit him? He will say, Ah, would that I had sent forth good deeds, for this my future life. For that day his chastisement will be such as none else can inflict, and his bonds will be such as none can bind. To the righteous soul will he be said, O thou soul, in complete rest and satisfaction, come back thou to thy Lord, well please thyself and well pleasing unto him. Enter thou then among my devotees, yea, enter thou my heaven. A small brief uh, again of Dr. Zakir Nayak, a medical doctor by professional training. Dr. Zakir Nayat is renowned as a dynamic international orator on Islam and comparative religion. Dr. Zakir clarifies Islamic viewpoints and clears misconceptions about Islam using the Quran, authentic hadith of the Prophet وسلم, and other religious scriptures as a basis in conjunction with reason, logic and scientific